biggest stunts in James Bond movie history is the barrel roll on The Man with the Golden Gun, starring the late Roger Moore. It's definitely a cheesy stunt, after all, what spy would go to the trouble of doing a barrel roll in pursuit of a villain? Yet it's still impressive, since the filmmakers actually jumped and rolled the car in real life for the shot. And though they did some crude 1970s era computer modeling, ultimately a stunt driver had to get behind the wheel and get it right the first time. In comparison, the recent Jaguar E-Pace barrel roll was practiced and performed autonomously a few times first. The Bond car, a 1974 AMC Hornet, survived the jump, and is now going to be sold by Auctions America. This Labor Day weekend, the auction house will offer this historic film car. It comes from the collection of Jay Milligan, the man who developed the barrel roll jump. According to Auctions America, Milligan was performing the jump before the film, with the first successful jump happening at the Houston Astrodome. Milligan then offered the stunt to the James Bond filmmakers. From there, modifications to the stunt were done for the movie shoot thanks to help from Calspen Corporation and some then high-tech computer modeling. The AMC was fitted with a roll cage, and the seat and controls were moved to the middle to keep the car balanced. 